Moving on now, the month-long protests in Thailand are a part of a mass movement against the ruling government. It is not represented by one single face or leadership, but it seems that the cheer for Anand Nampa at Thailand's biggest anti-establishment demonstration was the loudest. Anand Nampa is a 35-year-old lawyer, much older than student protesters who seek his counsel. He draws experience from years of court appearances he made to defend government critics and forms from earlier protests which he took part in. Today he openly challenges the King of Thailand and calls for curbing of the monarch's powers. This has shook the politics of Thailand like never before and made him a hero of the working class. Han was arrested within a day after he suggested radical reforms in Thailand's monarchy, but he was charged with unrelated incidents from earlier demonstrations as well. Meanwhile, protesting students followed up with a 10-point agenda demanding reforms to King Vajira Long Kong's monarchy. Now, Til An was released on bail on August 8th. On the contrary, the royal palace refused to comment on An's demands for change and advised the Prime Minister to not prosecute any protesters for the least majesty, an offence against the dignity of the reigning sovereign. Anand grew up in a small Iranian family in northeastern rural province. Now, the village is known for its opposition to Bangkok and for its deep-rooted left-leaning ideologies. After completing school, Anand took a plunge into public life. He started working with human rights activists in 2006 when populist leader was overthrown in a military coup. Soon, he enrolled as a lawyer in the bar, started practice and defended Thailand's weakest. In 2014, when former military commander Prayut chan -cha seized power, he defended dissenting activists, including those who had been charged with Lee's Majesty against the monarchy. Anand has now sought to reduce monarch's constitutional powers, which were expanded after King Mahavajira Longkorn succeeded his late father. In 2016, he also has been a major critic of Prime Minister Prayut for manipulating electoral rules shaped by the army and for forcefully keeping the constitutional chair. Earlier, he has been charged at least 12 times for organizing political events and gathering against the establishment. He has been fined several times and seven cases are still pending against him for having demanded fair elections. <laughs> Anand a lawyer has an immense passion for both history and literature and his spare time he writes poetry, revolutionary essays and opinion pieces. He is greatly inspired by Marxist ideology and 1950s Thai historian and activist Chit Bumisak.